Hi guys, it's Rebecca. Thank you so much for joining me for today's video. Today's video is going to be one of many finales that I'm going to be doing. Um, I have one, two, three, three projects that we're ending at the end of this year. Today is December 30th and I'm sorry about the lighting if it's a little too dark, but um, I wanted to film this right now because tomorrow I'm planning on filming my introduction video for a collab video that I'm doing with other 19 girls here on YouTube that do project pans and stuff and I'm very excited because it's my first collab video and I'll be I'm gonna be working with a bunch of girls that I watch uh, some girls that I don't know yet but um, you know I started watching their videos already getting to know them because of this um, this collab video that we're gonna be doing but um, anyway the video that I'm going to be doing today is going to be my finale for my Last Chance Project Pan, aka Project Pan Mini Lip Edition. And this project was um, just all lip products. I picked out eight mini um, lip products. And let's see how I did. I'm just going to go through them real quick. Um, if you guys want to see the video, I'm gonna, I, will leave, I will leave it linked up here. Good grief. Um, so this is the Tarte Park Avenue Princess. Completely finished it. Then the next one that I finished was this one from Clinique in the color Pink Honey. It's gone. Then the next one was from Bite Beauty in the color Flush. Right there. And the last one was this mini from Hourglass in the color Child. So you guys can see I took out the stopper. Oh, you can't see much. I'm filming at night and it's not very good lighting, but I took out everything. There, you can see a little bit better there. So yeah, I took out everything. Um, I had four products left as of last update and I am here to tell you guys that I finished them, yay! So uh, the first one that I finished, um, well, I can't remember, but um, I was able to finish this one from uh, Bare Minerals. I don't know if Pop of Passion is the line, the name of the line, but this was in the color Plumberry Pop. And I finished it completely all the way up. Um, oh gosh, this line sucks. Um, but yeah, I finished it up completely, so there you go. I really enjoyed this one. Then I finished this one from Marc Jacobs. This was a mini one that came in a, I think it came in in one of those give me some lip kits, I think, if I'm not mistaken. But yes, finished it out, took out the stopper, cleaned that baby out. And this one, honestly guys, I think I used this one up in three days. There was not a lot of product in here whatsoever, so. Then my least favorite of all of them was this Stila Stay All Day Vinyl Lip Gloss. And it looks like there's still product there. If I was filming during the day, you guys would be able to see a little bit better, but um, you guys can kind of see like the scrapes on the sides. And I also took out the stopper on this one and I cleaned it out completely. Um, you guys can see that. Um, I didn't like this one for many reasons. Well, I'll get to that later. So yeah, I finished this one and the last thing that I finished, I finished it yesterday actually and it was my most favorite, most, most, most favorite um, item of the ones that I picked out and it was this little mini one from Sephora. I got this with the purchase. I entered a code for this little, well I entered a code and they gave me three options uh, from the Sephora line. This one like the one of the rouge lipsticks and some other um, line of lipstick but I chose this one this is the cream lip stain and this is in the color one I think it's old way always red and I really I really did finish it I don't know if you guys can see through the bottle but down here I can't reach it anymore so here's the wand but then when I put it in to try to like bend it so it can reach the bottom, it doesn't. It just kind of like just scrapes the sides. You see, you guys see what I'm what I'm doing there? So I can't reach the product on the bottom. It's a very small wand to begin with. So, um, but this is no joke, you guys. I put it on. I 
um, dabbed my mouth once it dried. Oop. Once it dried, I dabbed my lips with a with a tissue paper, and oop, oop, and nothing transferred. Nothing, absolutely nothing. So this is amazing. I already added like three different shades to my loves list so that I can buy them in the future. But I was very very impressed with this product. Hands down, my favorite favorite item from these eight lips uh, lip products. So. There you go guys, yay! I was able to finish all eight items. Uh, I think it was like six weeks that I gave myself to finish these um, these items. My favorite one, like I said, was this one from Sephora. My least favorite one, hands down, was this one from Stila. It was supposed to be like a cream lipstick, I guess. Um, but it was very, it was very sticky. I needed them with most of them except for the red one from Sephora I could just reapply without using a mirror with this one I needed to it could because if I didn't you could see like lines if I missed a spot or whatever and the wand for this one was extremely extremely flexible like look at that and it smelled kind of funky I mean it looked pretty once you put it on but it was just like too high maintenance for an application you know what I mean I don't know. Well, that's it guys. I am glad that I was able to finish uh, these eight. I was trying to kick it into high gear towards the end of the year so I could get as many lip products as I could out of my collection and I'm glad I was able to get those eight um, out of the equation. I count, even the little ones, I count as one um, in my makeup inventory. So to get eight out in the last six weeks, that's pretty good, I think. So yes, guys, that is it. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for two more finales that are coming up and I will see you on my next video. Bye.